If you're like me and prefer a clean and organized workspace when you open Microsoft Word, you're in the right place. In today's video, I'm going to show you not only how to remove recent files, but also some additional tips to keep your Word environment clutter-free and efficient. Let's delve deeper into why a clean workspace in Microsoft Word matters. A clutter-free environment can significantly enhance your overall productivity and provide a sense of professionalism, especially when working in a collaborative or public setting. To initiate this process, scroll down the left-hand panel and select Options. This action opens a dedicated settings window that allows you to tailor your Word experience. Within this window, click on the Advanced tab, which is the gateway to a plethora of customization options. When it comes to customizing your Word environment, you're in control. The Show This Number of Recent Documents option empowers you to decide how many recent files will be displayed when you open Word. By default, it's configured to show the last 50 documents you've worked on, but you have the flexibility to redefine this number according to your preferences. While setting it to zero effectively eliminates recent files, you can also specify a specific quantity if you only want to see the most recent few. On the topic of pinned documents, it's wise to exercise restraint pin only the documents that are genuinely essential for quick access, maintaining the cleanliness of your workspace. Once you've skillfully adjusted these settings to your liking, affirm your choices by clicking the OK button located at the bottom of the window. This confirmation will not only implement your changes instantly, but also ensure that they persist every time you open Word in the future. It's a one-time configuration that makes your Word environment decluttered and ready for productive action. If this video was beneficial to you, please don't forget to show your support by hitting the like button and subscribing for more valuable tech tips. Additionally, feel free to share your thoughts, questions, or suggestions in the comments section below I am here to assist you. Thank you for tuning in, and until the next video, stay productive and organized in your digital workspace.